Hi, uh, this is uh, Kyle O'Donnell, the Travel Geek here, and uh, I'm reporting from my house right here in Malaysia. And I just got out of the shower a little while ago. <laughs> the funniest thing happened, I almost stepped on a cobra. <laughs> now, I've dealt with cobras several different times uh, since being in Southeast Asia, but darn it if I, I never had a camera around. So this time, I'm actually going to record it. Um, <clears throat> right now, He's underneath a canister, which I got a little bit of weight on. I put this um, tea pitcher on top of it. He's just a little bitty guy. He's like a, maybe a foot and a half, maybe a foot to a foot and a half long. He's not that big, but boy, is he angry. It's been an interesting surprise. Uh, the, the several times that I've had run-ins with Cobras, um, they've all been super nice, uh, but um, they don't really like attention. So when you're around them, they get a little pissed. Uh, if left to their own devices, they're fine. They're beautiful little animals. Um, but anyway, so he's, he's right here. And I'm going to attempt um, to put him in a jar so that I can let him go. I really don't want to kill him. Um, of course, I'll probably end up killing somebody else if I let him go. But that won't be on my conscience. Now, there's, there's two reasons that I'm filming this. The first is that, like I said before, I have, I've run into several cobras throughout my experiences here in Southeast Asia. The first couple of times was in, uh, was in Thailand, and I had uh, probably a four-foot-long, looked like a king cobra. I mean, it was angry and hissing and all kinds of craziness. It was in my backyard in, in Thailand. Uh, the second one was in my friend's backyard. But in any case, I, I didn't have a camera on me. And by the time I went and got my camera, he had, he had, he had gone his own way. Um, but the second reason is that uh, just in case I die <laughs> today while trying to get this little guy into a jar, um, I want at least my death to be funny to someone. <laughs> uh, I'd hate to die in vain, you know. So if somebody gets a good laugh out of it, I will have lived my life to the fullest. All right, here goes. Okay, so the cobra is right underneath this jar here. And um, what I'm gonna attempt to do is use this stick to flatten him out and then grab his neck and um, hopefully be able to put him face first into a pitcher, which is right here. This is my little empty water jug here. It's big enough to where I think I can let him go without him turning around and biting me. So, let's hope that works out, shall we? Okay. Now, he's gonna be pretty angry when I lift this up. So, I'm just gonna lift it up and back right off. There he is. Cute little guy. Not sure he realizes that there's anything really happening. I'm not making any big movements, so he's not flaring up just yet. But he will. Oh, definitely he will. Yeah. See there? He's just a little bitty guy. Ooh. All right.
Ooh. All right, now all I gotta do is grab them. Without him biting the fuck out of me. How do I do that now? Pretty scary here. King Cobra. Uh -huh. I sure do wish I'd get my cameras to work tonight. I don't really have them in focus. Yeah. So I'm going to try and put him in a jug now. Maybe. Just maybe. He won't bite me. He's got interesting marking. He's pitch black. pitch black. He might be a king cobra. Oh, he looks like craziness. All right. In you go, buddy. Oh, I really, really hope you go in there. and pissed off at everything. Anyway, so these are the tales of Southeast Asia. Well, that's about as much of Titan as I need for one day.